Hi, I'm Ken Rakowski and welcome to The Voice of Disruption. We're here to help you disrupt yourself by meeting people that are clearly disruptors themselves. And on today's show, we have three very interesting people. Probably you've never heard of any of them. You know, one individual has created one of the largest ways to find a place to live, specifically in the south side of California. Let's call it, it's called West Side Rentals. And Mark Verge is probably the accidental entrepreneur, an amazing individual. Later on, Taryn Peisner has worked on Wall Street. Now he owns multiple publicly traded companies. And the crypto king is going to join us, and that's Brock Pierce. And something you'll realize about all of them, they're fairly boring people. Yeah, boring, 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 boring. And the reason why is they're all around the idea of habits. They have the same habits, and they've been doing it for a long time. See, if you really look at the idea of successful people, and I want you to look at the Forbes top list, most of them on a Briggs-Myers test would have the I before everything. They're introverts. They're not external. They're not going off and impressing people. They're internal. They're all about finding ways to up themselves, taking themselves to another level. Yeah, it blows my mind because most of the time you think some of the best networkers out there are extroverts, but they're not. They know how to turn it on when it's needed, but when they go back, they're working on themselves. Again, look at the list. Look at who the top people are. Right now, Jeff Bezos sits on top as being the wealthiest person in the world. He's an introvert. Bill Gates, same thing. Mark Zuckerberg, what's going on with this idea of being true to yourself first before going off and impressing everybody else. See, that's the first key of success. You have to look internal. You have to work on yourself. These individuals have a unique ability to make sure they're upping their own personal game. Because you up your own game, your gain goes up too. So when we look at what our product is, what are we gonna make, what are we gonna do you have to look at yourself. You have to make you great first. All three people on the show today have found a way to make themselves great over and over again, reinventing themselves. So what are you? Are you about everybody else? Sure, it's about the we, not the I, but meaning you have to be of service for everybody. <laughs> it's fascinating to me. Initially, when I was young, I wanted to become a priest. I went into the priesthood. Yes, me, a Jesuit priest. Because I believed that a powerful community can change the world. And that's what I wanted to do. I wanted to be part of the world, but be part of the community. And as we move forward 30 years later on from my life, I realized that the community is what makes changes. But it needs somebody at the top that's selfless, not selfish. All about moving the community in a certain direction. Now, what is that community? Today, it's from cryptocurrency. It might be the next generation of the internet. It might be something that you're working on. But a great leader is different than a great boss. A great boss will say, go do. Where a great leader will say, let's do. And the whole change of today is we have to be part of the let's, as in a community. You have to be selfless. You have to work on yourself. Because as you work on yourself, your community around you becomes great and powerful. So what are you? Are you all about them or about the we? Bring it close, work together, and move forward. Again, let's do it together and make a change. And with our people today, our disruptors, they're making some huge changes. Again, Mark Verge, Westside Rentals, multiple restaurants all over Los Angeles. Walsh and McTaren Pizer. Now, I personally believe that a fairly famous movie a uh, character was developed by him. He'll deny it. And then Brock Pierce, who's literally changing the face of cryptocurrency. All of them are joining us today. We have a great show. Let's hang out. Let's have some fun. You're being here with us, part of we, on The Voice of Disruption. We'll be right back.